Uh, plenty of shopping still going on well into the evening after an already busy day after Christmas deals. So this is a live look at the madness, the mess that is the Kenwood Mall. Probably just as many returns as purchases today, if not more, on this day after Christmas. Uh, for much of the day, traffic has been backed up for a couple of miles either side of the uh, exit to Kenwood there on I-71. So patience, the key word if you were heading anywhere to shop this weekend. Now, despite the uh, mall madness that you're looking at, plenty of people already jumping in. Earlier today, WLWT News 5's Christy Davis was right there in the thick of it. If you made your way out to Kenwood Town Center today, you probably had a plan in place and money or gift cards burning a hole in your pocket. Uh, so we're going shopping. Let's go. <laughs> Wake up. It's time to get up. And shopping they went. Men, women, families, couples, even some folks all by themselves, all streaming to the mall, lured by the same thing. Sales, obviously. <laughs> <laughs> in nearly every store window, the markdowns were calling, creating a perfect opportunity. They can pick out their own stuff, and they're happy, and we're happy. Like usually, you look forward to the money, so then you can buy what you really yeah. want. <laughs> but getting what you really want can take more than one try. I love shopping regardless, so I was really excited, and I had to return a few things. Well, every year I buy stuff, but uh, very seldom I have to return anything. But this year was just one exception. The day after Christmas is the biggest day for exchanges and returns, and retailers offer those deep discounts to get shoppers to then buy something else, though they can't convince everyone to spend. I'm the man-to-man uh, -man defense. If, it, if I stayed at home, it'd been like a zone defense her with two <laughs> two kids. And really, that kind of teamwork can help make the day easier on everyone. At Kenwood Town Center, Christy Davis, WLWT News 5. All right, so we've got a couple of tips if you're planning on returning gifts. Of course, make sure that you have all the tags and receipts. And if the gift was ordered online, good idea. Take it to the store to return it and bring the packing receipt along with you when you do that.